what is up everybody hey today welcome back to the hunter call of the wild and today i figured i would show y'all the top five best spots to come out here and hunt on Reventuli coast um i've been wanting to do this video for a while now and it's very difficult to pick spots on this map because so many of them are so good like there are so many good places to hunt on this map and each one of them unique in its own way but I figured I've kind of singled it out to a few spots that are good for multiple species and are usually not as checked on multiplayer. Okay, so if you want to go to multiplayer, a few of these areas are not checked that much. So a couple of them are, they're very well known hotspots, but others are kind of just ones that get neglected a lot. So I figured I would go on ahead and show you all these today. Let's go on ahead and get right into this. All right, and for our first hot spot, we're down here in the archipelago, and basically it's the entire archipelago. It is just absolutely covered up in ducks. As you can see, we've already got a whole bunch of stuff starting to come in. Not a ton coming at the moment, but you can hear the calls starting to come in. I've been hunting a lot down here, so I've got a lot of hunting pressure. Not as many animals are coming to the spot for me. And y'all are going to notice this for some of the places on my own map here. Um, there will not be as many animals. That is because I've deleted a lot of zones over time. And animals have just moved locations on my own map. But if you go into multiplayer or check a nice new fresh map on your own, um, you're very likely to find some good stuff. And if you want to find some good ducks, the archipelago is the place to go. If you want to go multiplayer duck hunting, it's great. All five duck species are down here. Um, you don't have to know which ones are where. They're all right here. Super easy to find, not hunted a lot, and definitely a spot I recommend going. Now, our next hotspot constitutes a much larger area, but it is definitely a great spot worth coming to. I highly recommend coming here in the early morning. Everyone comes to this lake right here. Okay, I'll show it to you on the map. This little lake. It's going to be checked in every server you go to. If you find a server that has not had it checked, go there immediately. Um, but what's not often checked is the surrounding areas. All out here, all around this lake, is wide open and full of birds. Caper, Kaylee, hazel grouse, black grouse, you name it, it's out here. There's lynx, brown bear, moose, and whitetail, and uh, tundra bean geese, and Canada geese. So they're all out here in this area, and you it's an absolute amazing time to come out here and just find all sorts of animals. Um, like I said, the lake is great for all the larger animals and to run around. This is where I have found many of my diamond caper Kaylee. Um, I found one of my diamond black grouse out this way. Um, and I always search it for hazel grouse because it does seem to have quite a few more in here than other areas. Because hazel grouse are definitely very elusive. There are also rock ptarmigan. This is similar area to where I found my diamond rock ptarmigan. Just great areas. Animals all over the place. You come out here on your own map or multiplayer. I recommend coming in the early morning or around the drinking times at the lake. So yeah, another fantastic area to come out here and check. All right, and our third area to come and check here on Revenue to the Coast is going to be right down here, uh, kind of this little chunk here, and like to this tree stand. It's a fairly large area on this road right here. I usually start at this lodge and run down the road. Right now though, for sake of time, I'm starting over here. But this area is absolutely amazing for willow ptarmigan, uh, raccoon dogs, and moose. Again, like I said, when I'm trying to find the best areas, I'm trying to find areas with a multitude of species. And this place is amazing. It also has a um, lot of Eurasian widgeon, um, Eurasian widgeon, mallards, uh, sometimes some tufted ducks, and gray lag geese are all down in this area. Definitely recommend coming here. Um, this is where I found both my level 9 raccoon dogs, one diamond, one troll. I found a ra couple rare and a diamond willow ptarmigan down here. Absolutely amazing to hunt. And the best part about it is it is very rarely ever checked past right here. 
Sometimes this little area is checked, but usually everything from here over is not checked. And this whole area up here can be good as well, but I prefer down here because it tends to be a little more open. There's some big fields out here that you can really see. And I'm telling you, if you want a diamond willow ptarmigan or diamond raccoon dog, this is the place to come check. Well, we are now here at the number four hotspot, and this place is fantastic as well. Um, I'll go and show it on the map. It is the marsh area right up here. And kind of the surrounding woods tend to be really well for birds. But this little marsh is great because it's fairly open. Uh, you can see really well out across it. And it is just absolutely loaded with animals. Okay. There are just whitetail all over the place here. Um, it's another great place for moose. Highly recommend coming here for moose. Um, brown bear. It's a fairly decent area for them. But the lesser known secret um, is lynx. This spot is amazing for lynx. And it's also great for geese. It is a fantastic uh, spot for tundra bean geese and Canada geese. Just absolutely amazing. All kinds of stuff up this way for you to come find. And definitely worth a stop. Um, the only kind of bad thing about it is it is often checked on most multiplayer maps i think i've hardly been on any that haven't had it checked but it's like i said it's not often checked for links and it's a great goose spot and sometimes people miss things and it's always worth a check over here all right and we are at the last spot but certainly not least is going to be this little area down here on the map these kind of little twin lakes right here and all the surrounding woods are fantastic okay it's a great place for moose brown bear lynx and whitetail as well as birds like hazel grouse caper Cayley, black grouse and uh, mountain hare as well are also fairly prevalent down in this area but i definitely recommend checking here in multiplayer this area is not usually checked um in my opinion it's one of the best moose spots there's usually several moose zones all around this lake. Um, now, mind you, my map is a little depleted at this spot because I've hunted it very hard. And I've deleted quite a few of the zones here. But it is a fantastic spot to come and check if you ever have time. If you need to get away from other people on multiplayer or um, just try and find a new area. Check somewhere on your map. Definitely recommend coming here. A lot of birds, a lot of big game, and definitely a worthy spot to come and check. Well, guys, that is going to be it for this video. I hope you all enjoyed. Let me know what you thought of it down below. What are some other great spots that you know of on Reventuli? I'd be happy to hear. But, uh, yeah, let me know if you find anything cool on your own maps here, or multiplayer for that matter. And, uh, yeah, hope you all enjoyed this. Hope it was helpful, and I will see you next time.